Don't you think that humans are astonishing? We can build relationships to many different things. Oh, for example, to each other. Yes, and when that happens, when two people interact with each other... Miracles can happen. And we want to start very simple today. We want to start with a simple cup and with a simple die. And with one member of the audience, I will just come down to you for a second and maybe... Yes, so right here. Do me a favor, just stand up. What is your name? Johannes. Johannes, take the cup, take the die, put the die inside the cup, put your hand on top, shake it, and let us know, Johannes, what number is on top. Uh, five. Uh, just have a look, much easier. <laughs> five. Five, lucky you, okay. <laughs> One more time, yeah. And have a look, what number is it this time? Two. Two, okay. We'll do it one last time, a little bit different. Hand goes on top, arms like this. Now, shake it as long as you like. He's going for it, yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, in a second, Amelie and I will turn around. As soon as we are looking away, you will have a peek what number is on top, but don't show it to anyone. Don't say it to anyone. Don't change it, okay? <laughs> we'll turn around, you will have a look. You know the number. Hand is still on top, I'll turn around. Do me a favor, turn around this way, face Amelie, and count loud from one to six now. One, two, three, four, five, six. Well, it's interesting, Johannes, because first you started to count a little fast, and towards the end you got a little slower. Did you realize that? Yeah. Um, so, I think it was a low number because you tried to get over it. Okay. 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 Yeah. I don't think it was a high number. It was not a five and not a six. And also, there was something slightly different in your voice. Okay. When you said the number two. I think you wrote the two, didn't you? Is that yeah. correct? Yes. Can I have a look? Yes, it is number two on top. <laughs> Thank you, Johannes. Thank you very much. Thank you for helping. You see, that's how easy women read men's minds. Yeah. Uh, but tell me, what if we try it the other way around? I would love to. Yes. But you know what? Let's keep things random. Uh, Johannes, just stand up one more time and have a look. We have a couple hundred people here. Probably half of them are male, half of them are female. I need one lady from the audience. Uh, okay. You can select anyone, but best someone you don't know. I don't know. I don't always... Mm. Oh, you know everyone, though, right? This one. <laughs> uh, this one. Yes. A little bit more specific? Um, I don't know, this black lady there. Here. Dark hair? Dark hair? Okay, yeah. perfect. Right. Thank you so much, Johannes. Uh, hello, what is your name? My name is Kulu. Oh. Kulu, can you stand up for a second? I will give you... The cup, one more time, and the die. Put it inside, hand on top, Kalu. Shake it, also as long as you like. <laughs> you look excited. Yes. Yes. Uh, hand stays on top. Yeah. I will turn around. Yeah. You will have a peek. Don't show it to anyone. Don't say it, okay? You know the number? Yeah. Hand is still on top? Yeah. Perfect. Kalu, because you are allowed to lie now, okay? Okay, yeah, she looks happy, okay. Uh, <laughs> I will ask you a couple of questions and you will always say yes, even if you have to lie, understand? Yes. Perfect. Okay. <laughs> Kulu, you're old number one. Yes. Okay, you thought about it. You're old number two. Yes. Why do you look away? <laughs> uh, you're old number three. Yes. Oh, that was a little bit too much, but okay. You're old number four. Yes. Yes? Okay. You're old number five. Yes. <laughs> She's good, okay. Uh, you're old number six. Yes. You looked in this direction with number six, okay. I don't think it was a six and a five. Uh, just continue with saying yes, you're old number one. Yes. You're old number two. Yes. You look at me at two. Okay, you're, you're old number three. Yes. You're old number three. Yes. You're old number three. Yes. I think I have it. You're old number one, yes? Yes. Can I have a look? Yes. <laughs> yes, it is number one on top. <laughs> Thank you, Kulu. Your applause.
but okay. I understand, people say it's one out of six. You know what? Let's make it one in a million. And I see uh, you have a beautiful handbag with you. Do me a favor, take your handbag, open your handbag, and take out one object, one item you brought with you from home, whatever you like, it just should fit into my palm and place it on my hand. First, there is exactly one object in my hand. Amelie, what is it? It is a very light object. You can unfold it, you can open it, and there is something made of plastic glass. You can see through it. Those must be glasses. And I'm pretty sure those are sunglasses. That's correct. Yes, it is. Sunglasses. Thank you so much. Um, by the way, hello, I'm Tommy. What is your name? My name is Anna. Anna, you have a beautiful handbag as well. Uh, do me a favor, Anna, just stand up for a second with your handbag. Um, yeah, put all the things on the, on the chair. Uh, I will take your handbag in my left hand. I will take your left hand in my right hand. And you come and join me on stage. Give Anna some encouragement. <laughs> right into the middle. Because um, every time when we perform, where Amelie is able to feel items I'm holding in my hands, people think, okay, I don't know, there must be something in her ear, like a little loudspeaker, uh, something like that, or other electronic devices. Exactly, Anna. So to verify that we're not using any of this, would you help us out and check if there is anything inside my ear or behind my ear? Antennas coming out of my ear. Earphones, whatever, nothing suspicious. She's very thorough. Very thorough. Uh, maybe my left ear. Check it out. You're the eyes for the audience. All good? Everything is clear and clean. Oh, that's good. Thank, Thank you. you. <laughs> Just come over here. Just come over here. Also, people say, okay, there must be, I don't know, a monitor. Amelie must be able to see something. That's why I have a blindfold with me. Do me a favor. Check out the blindfold. There is nothing inside. There is nothing hidden. No flat screens. No Wi-Fi? No? Nothing. Oh, you know what? Hold it against your eyes, just to confirm, just to verify. Can you see through it? No. No. Thanks so much, Anna. And now, come to my right side over here, and look for one interesting object out of your handbag. And I have no idea what's inside, but it's quite heavy. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Anything you brought with you from home, take it outside and place it on my right hand. Now, Amelie, let's do this. Okay. Anna, you already chose something. It's a small object. There is okay. something like a plug or it has something to do with electronics. There is a lot of stored data. Is that a flash drive? Okay, that's correct. Yes. And I is. think there's space for two gigabyte, isn't it? Oh, is that correct? Two gigabyte, yes. Thank you so much, Anna. <laughs> this is your applause. Thank you for helping. Thank you. Are you ready? I'm ready. And now, ladies and gentlemen, please do me a favor. Look in your pockets, look in your handbags, in your pockets for any objects, any items you brought with you today, whatever you like. Make it difficult, hold them up, but do not say what it is. Yes, because that is my job. Anything you brought with you today. Yeah. Okay, now let's start with this. That is a cell phone. Color? Black. Oh, the provider? Is that T-Mobile? Is that correct? Yes. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you. Next, please, this. Oh, okay. So, okay, what is it? This has something to do with, um, with beauty. Um, yes. Something like lipstick. Can I open it? Is it correct? Yes. Yes, it is. Is there a number on it? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> now, so try the number. I, I think there is a number, and it must be it's a three-digit number, I believe. It's, I quite like the shade, too. It's nice. It's a nice Me color. Too. It's a lipstick number 510. Is that How? correct? <laughs> Thank you! Um, next this. You can go on. Oh, you took another item. Now I feel it. It contains liquid, doesn't it? Something like drops. So um, that's correct? It's an eye drop. Eye drops, that is correct. Thank and you. Then there is an expiration date, an expiry date. 
Um, you can use them till next year. Uh, that must be February 2018. Yes? Yes. Thank you so much. Thank you. A big round of applause for Amelie, by the way. Thank you very much. <laughs> I just heard it. I know there are theories. Just someone said, okay, there must be a camera or something. Can you have a look in my sleeve? There is no camera here. <laughs> yeah, you like that, I know. Okay, <laughs> nothing here, nothing in my hair. Okay, nothing on the tie, on my jacket. Microphones, all good. Okay, whatever. Um, I will come to the other side as well. Now, Amelie, we'll look for any objects, any items. Uh, Make it difficult, whatever tummy. you like. Hold. Tommy. Yes. You talk too much. <laughs> Thank you, honey. Is there already another item on your hand? It is so light. Is it? It's like a triangle. Very light, very thin. It's, I can hardly feel it, but... Oh, you know what? That must be, um, how's it called? Like, guitar pick. It's true. Yes? Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you very much. Wow. That was really challenging. I like that. Let's go for something more. In this case, I would say that's something you've never used before. That's a brush. Yeah. <laughs> yes, and there is something special about it. Because you see yourself in it, there is a mirror with it. Yes. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. You can go on. That was very smart, by the way. Okay. Um, hmm. That's something made of plastic, like, but it's hard material. There must be a a car key. Yes. Yeah? Are you driving? I'm not so good with car brands, but I believe that you're driving... Am I close? Mercedes? Yeah. It's a Mercedes! Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> it looks so similar, like it feels similar. But anyways, um, that's something you can, you can press. It's warm, isn't it? It's a lighter. Yes. Yeah, that's true. Please, the color. It's green. Okay, the brand. That's a big. All correct? <laughs> All correct. Thank you so much. A big round of applause <laughs> for Amelie, by the way. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you. I have to tell you, you are all amazing and there are so many great objects. I would love to take everything, but I know there are a lot of theories. People think, okay, there must be something in or on my jacket. So today I will take my jacket off. And I don't know if you heard about it, but there is a theory out there. I have no idea why, but they say I'm communicating through my shoes. Um, so I will take my shoes off. I will put them right here. And if you like, please come check them out. Look inside, do whatever you uh, like. I would not recommend that. <laughs> so Thank hot. you, Amelie. <laughs> But no, sorry. Let's keep it random. I'm going to throw this kiwi. <laughs> it's summer. Uh, into the audience, please catch it. Oh, good catch with one hand. Uh, because, sir, right in the middle, I need some money. Do you have your wallet with you? Is there some cash inside? Also, some bills? Paper money? Yes, stand up, come over here. That's your applause. <laughs> I need one banknote. Any banknote you have in your pocket, take it out and place it on my hand. Come over here. Yes, no banknotes. No banknotes? Uh, yes, uh, expensive. Okay, borrow one. We have a couple hundred people here, so probably there are a couple thousand euro or whatever. If you have some money with you, just hold it up into the air. He will give it back, maybe. Uh, <laughs> you can borrow any, any banknote you like and place it on my, my hand. We'll try it. Oh, there is already a banknote on your hand, Tommy. 
And I believe the person who gave it to you doesn't trust us too much. <laughs> but it's a 10, 10 euro bill, isn't it? That is correct. Sure. A good Amelie. So, Amelie the Impossible. So, you all know there is a serial number on every single bill. And that's exactly what I want to know from Amelie. If she is correct, do me a favor and just confirm after every number into the microphone. Okay. Wow, okay, that's going to be challenging. First one, two. You watch very closely. The first number is a four, it's a two, then there is a three. Yes. Another three. Yes. A one. Yes. Another one. Yes. And the last four numbers. I sense another one. Yes. Um now everything. The is next correct. number must be an is, is correct. Then there's I believe an eight. Yes. A no. There are two the numbers last. left, right? Sure. It's yes. a five. Exactly. And the last number. Last. Is a nine. So cool. That's yes, correct. That's the correct. bill you borrowed. So and all the numbers. And there is and there is the, the two letters oh. or. Yes. It's a, an, an N. And then exactly. A. Exactly. Is and that the, correct? An N and then what? A. Yes. <laughs> is that correct? Yes. Correct. The bill, the full serial number, yes? It's correct. Yes, it is. A big round of applause for Amelie. Thank you for the challenge, sir. <laughs> Sorry, what is your first name? Martin. Martin, you have to return the money first, Martin. Uh, and do me a favor, Martin. Reach out one hand like this. So, Amelie, his birthday. Hello, Marty. Hello. 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 I think your birthday is towards the end of the year. It's true. I sense it's November. Yes. Yep. So next exact day. I'll try the exact day. And like the way you are and you're very curious about everything, I would say that your star sign is Scorpio. Yes. Yes. <laughs> I knew it. And your birthday is on November 17th, 18th. November 19th. Yes? Yes. Yes, it is. Thank you so much, Martin. This is your applause. Ladies and gentlemen, Amelie Van Tuss. Thank you very much. And Tommy Ten. Thank you.